is Marianne and today I'm here to react to episode 9 of Julie and the Phantoms which is of course the hopefully season finale. <laughs> so I've got a renewal for season 2 and it's funny because I was actually googling like looking up uh, Netflix cancellations recently because there are, are a couple other shows that I'm waiting to see if they get cancelled or renewed as well and literally one of the articles that popped up like unprompted was like Julie and the Phantoms fans irate at Netflix's lack of season 2 renewal by now and it is true because it's like Netflix I feel like either like renews or cancels shows pretty quickly like within like the month then either like renews them after like a couple months I could see to see like their traction and stuff see how well they do like over time or it just freaking like never says anything and then like cancels it all of a sudden like six months later so it's just like can we get an answer please oh you trust Willie now <laughs> just kidding I love Willie oof no, obviously not you know they're not <laughs> Can you guys get out? Yeah, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Luke. Kiss! 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 No, I don't want- oh, Okay, a hug is good, too. Aww. Willie better be back next season, guys. I mean, there better be another season, but then Willie also better be back. Yeah, that's a, that's a good idea. Is that the last we see of Willie? No, I want to see more of Willie. Willie, don't. That's still so rude. <laughs> but for you, it's cute. I like how everyone else around them has umbrellas except for the ghost. That's a cool touch. Luke, your handwriting sucks. We've established that. <laughs> they lifted him up. What the heck? Please tell me that was unscripted. I kind of like that if it's just like um Jake and what's his face. Terry from Brooklyn Nine-Nine when like if Jake just runs at him Terry will grab him like I hope that's what the boys are like in real life oh no he's gonna recognize them right and she's already suspicious oh no does he have goons or something yeah but they're gonna miss their life yeah oh Oh, jeez. Well, thanks for the reminder. What would rhyme with that, Reggie? Oh, gross. Reggie, TMI. Oh, no. Her brother's gonna eavesdrop on this conversation with Luke. Aww. That's so sweet. What a sweetheart. This is the future I want. Forget bad boys, forget like the douches of like the early 2000 CW shows. I just want himbos who simp for their main girls and guys. I wonder how long after the last episode this episode is because they put this plan into motion rather quickly and I am very impressed. <laughs> totally missed them. Cause you're not very subtle. Yeah. Oh damn! Do they have to? Oh fudge, fudge. That means he found out from Willie. Don't tell me you killed Willie, or whatever the word is for killing a ghost. You need to get out of there right now. No, he definitely can. Don't say that to a villain. Yeah, that's kind of the whole point. Oh, fudge. How did I know? They should have poofed when they had the chance to poof. Well, about that. True, but maybe not if she just threw up. <laughs> oh, fudge. I just made the connection. Do you think Trevor and Caleb know each other? Oh, fudge. Yeah, I was going to say that's what's important right now. No, no, please don't touch him. I don't like that. They all hurt, sir. But they'd rather just drain out, I think, than like accept your offer. It's kind of, I thought like accepting Caleb's offer was the bottom of the three options like draining out, 
crossing over is the optimal. Yeah, okay, at least she knows it. Well, <laughs> you think that, but... Wait till she finds out they're against their will, technically, but rocking out at that stage. I'd be like, turn san tangible so I can whack you. She's going to sing, isn't she? I feel a song coming on. Aww. Oh my gosh, yeah, Julie's mom would get killed in the freaking face. Aww. Who's that? Aw, thank you, kind lady. <laughs> this woman says nothing, just sees a person sobbing and is like, flower. It's literally Gorda from Fantasy High. It's such a tiny place for something that they were like such a big deal. <laughs> it can't fit like that many people. Aw. She's going to have a solo, isn't she? And then the boys are going to come, I think is what's going to happen. Because it's supposed to show that she can perform without them, you know? I'm glad she's performing without them though at least because remember this is like a re like a redo of the dance when she couldn't sing without them now she can oh. that was weird but expect i mean the song fits a solo because she's saying like from the last one standing <gasps> yay i was kind of hoping maybe her music would overpower caleb's thing oh his hair looks good love it Oh, his hair looks good too, dang. Oh, and then we have Hat Boy. His hair looks like Steve's from Stranger Things. I love it. Okay guys, Reggie and Julie's friendship I feel like is so underrated, but I love all their scenes together. Hey, Alex gets to sing, that's dope. And Reggie, that's awesome. We can stop showing Nick, it's fine. <laughs> they only do one song though? Carrie? What, what's up? Were you moved by that? Why are you saying that? So they're, it's the one song, one and done. Aww. So now she's proud of her friend. This guy's like, because <laughs> he's like, Julie's going to know. What if like next season is him just like trying to take out Julie because she knows. <laughs> yeah, her dad was great. Like he never, ever got like overreacting, upset. Oh, and he's so sweet too. <laughs> Subtle kid. So are they there? Did they... I mean, they're, they're there. I'm, there's going to be a season two. I'm not going to think they're gone. Unless, again, season two is about the boys being gone and Carrie's dad just hunting down Julie. <laughs> uh, of course, Reggie's the one that breaks it, too. What the? What are they doing? Did they get booted back here? Why are they all just laying on the ground like that? Oh, fudge. It didn't work. What could the... Oh, my gosh. Reggie looks like hung over. They were gonna leave without saying goodbye. They look like they are going through it. Jeez. Aww. Uh, hold the front door. How is she touching him? Who's gonna, Alex gonna be the first one to notice. <laughs> Wait, he's glowing. He's Edward Cullen. Go hug them, please, quickly. Band circle, or whatever you called it before. Reggie's like hobbling over. <laughs> Jeremy Shaw has sold this performance, I'm sorry. He's like, you want me to play a ghost that's sick? I got you. Um, so are we gonna like look into Julie? Is she like a ghost conduct? <laughs> What's the word when like you can channel energy? Hey. She's gotta be like, have some type of power. Unless her mom like... I don't know, did it, but... Aw, are they gonna glow permanently now, though? Can everyone? No, because she's the only one that could see them, so she's probably the only one that could touch them. She's so short in comparison, like, when they're all, like, circle up like this. Oh, no. Nick, it's, it's over. I'm sorry. She told you she likes someone else. Move on. Uh, wait, what? 
that's his question, I would be like, who are you? Ew. That's freaking gross. <laughs> the way you just turn around and be like, so he's going after Julie now. I see. I kind of figured that because I was like, if she's obviously like her power of whatever she has is stronger than Caleb's power of controlling the boys, like your option would be, okay, then I'm going to take out, like if I couldn't get the boys, then I'm going to take out the thing that is special to them. You know what I mean? Like if her power's big, bigger than like what he's doing, like he's going to go after her. So then if she's out of the way, then he can go after the boys and there's nothing there to stop him. I feel like that's his plan now is just to try and I don't know if, He's gonna like take her out or like possess her eventually like a body hopping situation but it's gonna be interesting to say the least because I feel like he there's definitely a reason why he wants them so specifically like I don't think it's just because like they turned him down and he's like it's my pride but I think like they're probably like they've got some type of power and I feel like that's probably how he has been sustaining his power is through like he finds like other powerful ghosts or something like that and like takes their energy takes their magic and then uses it as his own so I feel like the boys are probably some of the most powerful he's come across in a while since like someone can actually see them. And I feel like he's going to want to, he really, really wants that power. So now he's going to go after Julie to try and get her out of the picture so then he can have the boys back to him and all that. And I just, I see the writing on the wall. But basically we need a season two confirmation because fanfic can only sustain me for so long. Just kidding. I have been reading so many Julie and Luke fan fictions in the last two days. It is... It's actually quite impressive how many, but how little sleep I've been getting. So that was a really, really great finale. I will say with this show, I think I didn't love it so much in the beginning, but it definitely gets better the longer and longer you go on. I feel like just as you get used to the characters and the relationships and everything like that, like I think it took me about to like episode like four to like really, really love it. And then after that, like each episode just kept getting better and better. So I'm really interested to see what season two is going to be like now that I am more invested in the characters and everything like that. And yeah, I just think it was really, really cute. So yeah, I super, super enjoyed it. And thank you guys all who recommended it to me. And I appreciate all the comments and likes and you guys all watching the video and commenting on it, like I said, with all your reactions. It's been super awesome to watch this with all of you and hopefully we'll be able to do it next year with a season two, fingers big crossed. So thank you guys all so much for watching. Make sure to leave your thoughts about the finale and what your predictions are for season two down below in the comments and I will see you guys next time. Bye.